Hey people, welcome to the whole tip daily. Sacred geometry is the shit. Not only is it tattooed on every messed out raver, it's also the pattern of everything in the freaking universe, to put it simply. This proves two things to me. We are all connected, aw, and we're all living in a simulation. I had my aha moment during a snowstorm. Seeing the pattern of each tiny individual little snowflake was when it really clicked. This universe is by design. There's a few more fun facts that affirm this theory as well. Another one being that everything is made up of atoms. I've always known this, but never thought about it in this light before. Atoms are mostly space. 99.99999% empty space. Wouldn't that mean everything in the universe is mostly empty space? Wouldn't that mean nothing is solid? Whoa, something to think about. Some people even believe Donald Trump winning the presidency is a sign that the simulation is malfunctioning. Let's see if things start to get even weirder. I sure hope so. The Mandela effect is a strange phenomenon that makes me a little suspicious of this so-called biological universe. There's plenty of other reasons that go beyond my realm of explainability, such as ways electrons act, encoding computer codes into DNA, cough cough Bill Gates vaccine, and the laws of the universe. Personally, I feel the mere chance that we are in a simulation is enough to add to your list of reasons to fight back against the system and the new world order. If you're playing a video game, do you play it safe and boring, or do you go all out and try to make it a little fun? Clearly, I'm not an expert in this arena. I'm not a physicist or whatever. This is just all the stuff that convinced me of the simulation theory. And it's not just some crackpot conspiracy. Lots of scientists are on board with it. What do you think? Are we living on some tweeny bop aliens computer screen? Who knows? Well, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.